Hey guys, here is me, Easy here again. Today I'm going to show you on the Manta Networks uh, Dolphin Testnet. Uh, basically, what it, uh, this uh, Manta Network does is that it provides a privacy function for the Polkadot Network and the Kusama Network. So, uh, currently, they won the uh, parachains auction for the Kusama Network, and on the Kusama Network, they are called the Kalamari Network. They try to uh, for the bidding of the slot on the polka dot network but they have didn't want it in the first round so they but they are now focusing on the development on this uh, dolphin testnet for, on to, to work on this privacy related transaction before they focus on the parachains auction on the polka dot okay so let's uh, look at how to do the dolphin testnet First of all, you need to go to the uh, GitHub to download the Dolphin Testnet Signer. This Dolphin Testnet Signer is something like a wallet for the Dolphin Test uh, for the Dolphin Testnet. Basically, what it does is uh, it allows you to sign the transaction whenever you do a privacy transaction on the Manta network. So you choose the Windows version if you're using Windows or a Mac OS version. Okay. After downloading, you get to something like this when you start after you install it. Okay. You then you first uh, install the program. They will ask you to create a password. So you create a password and then uh, click on the create account, it, and then you get. To this page where they will ask you give you the 12 character seed words. So you copy down the seed words and then save it, uh, put it somewhere safe so nobody can know it. Whoever who controls this uh, key combination of their key, the seed words will control your account. Okay. So this is a bit different from the MetaMask seed phrase, it's uh, only used for the Manta signer. Okay, so after you get your Manta signer, you you have one uh, logo. So let's start it, Manta signer. Okay, so you have your password. Okay, so this is after you successfully enter the password. This is uh, considered signing. So then you can go to the testnet address, okay, which is app.dolphin.nantano.network, which I'll post later. So uh, when you have your signer uh, working, it will show your version number here. And then this one here is your poker dot address, okay. So the on the Test page itself, there's two uh, options. One is to do a public transaction and another one to do a private transaction. In order to do a private transaction, you need to transfer some tokens from your public network to the private network. Okay. But uh, for the test net, we are going to use test token. So to get the test token, you need to join the Discord group. After joining the Discord group, Go scroll down to this channel called Dolphin Forset, and then you need to type in the command. Give me uh, doll. Give me Akala. Give me BTC. So doll is the Dolphin token that is uh, going to be used by this uh, Manta network. Okay. So this is the first one that you need to uh, request from, but I already requested it, so I will be showing uh, Dolphin. So I'm going to show you how to get a Kusama. So, okay. I say, give me KSM, then you paste your Polkadot, sorry, paste your Polkadot address. Let's copy the Polkadot addresses. Page. This is your product address. So you copy this address, go to the Dolphin Testnet, KSM, 
space, the address, okay? Then they will, the bot will send the uh, program, the send a test token to you, okay? Sometimes it doesn't work, so let's try again. So let's try another one, Dimi Eater. Okay, yeah, this one works, okay? So let's assume that I already received some test tokens, okay? This one I request previously. So if you want to just transfer normally from one uh, public address to another public address, where you don't need any uh, privacy related transaction, you can just send like this. Okay, so, so for example, if I send 0 0.5, then I paste my destination address there, press this, then they will send. But if you want to send it to a private address, what, uh, to make this transaction private, first of all, you need to send your dot to the your private uh, wallet. So for example, now I'm sending 0 0.5 dot there. Okay. So move into your poker dot password. So now it's sending. Okay. Uh, for public transaction, it all this transaction will be viewable via the sub dot ID. Uh, all this uh, blockchain explorer. Okay, now it's successfully deposited. So let's go to and click, click on this. It's showing the, what you have in the private. So just uh, now I send 0 0.5, but I previously already have 0 0.1 here. So now it's become 0 0.6. So why are these uh, private? So you can send this dot privately to another address. To, so on the private polka dot network, you have the address is not uh, like a normal polka dot address. It will be much longer. This is uh, something like an encrypted address. So I can send it back to myself, but I wouldn't do that. So if you, let's say you have another friend, then you can ask him for his uh, private address then you can send it there. So basically this is uh, how you uh, do a private transaction on the Dolphin testnet. So uh, on the Dolphin testnet, there are some other function like swapping, but this is not yet working. So for example, if you want to swap uh, from one uh, token to another token privately, you can use this function. So for example, I want to swap from dot to another Osama, for example, I can swap, but uh, this uh, swap function button is disabled. I guess the function will be coming soon. So that's all I have for today. May, if you have any question, you can leave your comments down below and then I'll try to answer them. Okay, thanks guys.